he he actually has that thousand yards there, so I think there's something wrong with him. We gotta get him to the hospital, man. He's yeah. French. Right. So here we are. Oh, he's French. We have three llamas. Yeah. One llamas. I'm gonna just do a wee bit of a bolt test. A bolt test on the, the, some of the features. They all look funky paintwork because they're getting remounted, so yeah. I think they look splendid. I like my bunch schnitze. Yeah, uh, wait, hang on, I'm gonna focus on focal focal on the uh, for a second, hang on. Focus! Right, but, uh, I can see your London light is on. Can you switch it off? It's on the it's same as the gazelles on the connected. I know where it is. It's right here. Yep, it's off. Can you remove your doors, please? Control D. Bam. Oh, huh? oh no! It works on mine. No, no. Uh, yeah, it works on yours, but it's not working on multiplayer. Okay, the problem with that. Okay, can you select one of the configurations, please? If you run payload, I'm at basic airframe. Which is what I see at the moment. So, yep. This, oh. this is SARS. SARS, yes, I see all your SAR kit and your doors has disappeared, so yes, the, mul the, the payload of a multiplayer works. Way hey. So, that's a start. Payload of a multiplayer works. Cargo. Oh, cargo. Mm -hmm. Watch that S, cargo. Actually, I can see the problem with the glass there. Passenger okay. configuration. Passenger configuration. Yep, I see that. Yep. Um, so if you if you select SAR, actually down those um, what's it like the crates that you, yeah, that, the that you have like the, in the other carriage or the baskets? Yeah, the baskets. There's a transparency issue with the baskets. I know of. Yeah, I tell you that's actually almost it's like the same issue that they have. It's like um, some of those faces are not um, their uh, uh, face normals are not. Facing them in the right direction, I'd say. They should all face outwards. Mm, yes. Yep, yeah, okay. So, right, let's progress to the sound and flight. Gentlemen, start your engines. Oh, I thought you'd never ask. Zipping her up. Whoa! I'm an next time you and the both of these two just started at exactly the same time. Yeah! There's a very slight difference in tone which makes it sound all about. Phasing! Phasing on stun. <laughs> yep. Revving her up to 100%. It works, the sound works, yes. Very nice. nice. Very funky. Super duper now. Ooh, nice sounds. Llama sounds. Nah. Nah. <laughs> right, let's, uh, I'll just follow you two guys. You can fly and do some analysis on the flight mode. Uh -huh. I'm not very good at this, so. <laughs> All right, gentlemen, if you want to follow me.
Well, where did you go? Uh, <laughs> what the hell? Uh, wait a what second. Oh, what, what direction? Uh, um, uh, <coughs> do hickey. Um, on your two o'clock. Did you pick me up? Yeah. See you. All right. Alex is doing. Gotcha. Alex is going to be doing the, the overhead panel for this as well. Listen. Nice. So you're all different configurations, so you have different weights to contend with. Yeah, what's the uh, drop dead speed on this, 110? Uh, 110, 115. Oh, they're pretty cool. I like them. It's like, um, I think what we could do is like we could add a bit of a bass component to the um, uh, to our own sound. What do you think of that? You know, so that, that it actually sounds a little more um, close and uh, yeah, yeah, close up, more close up. Yeah, if you want. Yeah. So it's, it would just be something that is actually audible. Um, I don't know, um, up to a distance of like maybe 10 meters, 15 meters. Okay, let's see. Like beyond that bridge, there should be the area where we uh, where we flew around last time. I think. Yeah. I'm gonna try to die with the squirrel. Let us know if you are successful. Well, if you can't fly the old squirrel, you're never gonna be flying the new one, tell you that now. Nice, so the lights are working a little bit there as well. I can see your stroll. Nice. Oh, vibration. Not too fast. Uh, not yeah, yeah. Ah! Uh, did you know? Got to throttle her down. Did you know it's a bit the the, the cockpit vibration mode in it? Oh, it didn't vibrate for me yet, though, uh, but <laughs> I think just because I did it right. <laughs> oh, what's happening? It's me, me here, not you. Oh, it's still that issue with the chin up, yeah. I'm over you. Let's see, maybe we find a place to land. Let me catch up to you again. Yeah. Uh. 
winchman should work over a uh, lot there as well. There's a radio post. Um, let's see if we can uh, settle down there. I'm on the ground with my own. Focusing on you two at the minute. It's hard to watch with you two up to see how things are behaving when I'm trying to find myself. Okay. Okay, uh, wait a sec, I gotta see... Ah, oh, there it is, yeah. It's below me. Yeah, I'm about to land. Alright, you're, you're above him, uh, Voodoo. He's landing at the base of the mast. Roger that. We got quite some flat area here. That's a good yeah, spot. Just don't hit the mast. Yeah. That's what I wanted to see. The multiplayer particle system is working perfectly. Very nice. Very nice. Well, that works. Bonus. Cool. Alright, I'm down. I see Voodoo. Ah. I can see Voodoo. Yep. Two o'clock. I can see his lights against the sky. Very good. Gonna go AFK for about 10 minutes. Roger. Roger that. Roger that. User left your channel. Over here, over here. Without hitting the mast. Yeah, you gotta fly around the mast, uh, though, Voodoo. Yeah, not, not, not through it. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think I would, yeah. it, it's sort of growing on me, you know. Aww. Now it's cool, it's like, um, uh. you know, it, it's behaving, it's not behaving like the new ones, like, you know, um, so it's a bit of a challenge. It's, it's good. The Buddha, I'm on your, uh, you turn it towards me. 12 o'clock now, below you. If you watch Voodoo in third person, you'll see the, the, dust, the dust effect and then it gets lower. Oh, wait a sec, yeah, I gotta, gotta try that. Yeah, go back up to the back up. Oh, yeah. Now I can what? see it. Yeah, what? Nice, nice. That's cool. That's really nice. Yeah. Ah. I can fill that, <laughs> filter that out to the other choppers. It uses about uh, three multiplayer properties. Uh, but it, work, it works. So, yep, it does. That's nice. It works well. Uh, Let me just uh, do a little screenshot here. Thank you. I wonder if when uh, Mark's edited the AC file to retexture map it, that's what's upset the glass. Because it wasn't like that before. Maybe. It wasn't like that before. Yeah, 
Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. You know, it might, might happen. It's not important to fix it. I'm going uh, 20 degrees roughly, Blue. If you push it to its limits, you'll see the, the, the dashboard and stuff and tell me it's starting to vibrate and rattle. Okay, let's do it. Um, I'd rather not, because I hate that. <laughs> <laughs> because it's hard to control them, because it just uh, doesn't look good. Enough. It scares me. It scares me. <laughs> you start to lose control, and shit starts go. Stuff starts going. Things start going. Chicka, 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 chicka. I can imagine my teeth chattering out of them. <laughs> out of my head. All right, I'm in the. I'm over the rant. Uh, nothing happens. Keep going. 115 knots, it's like he got knocked in the air. Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> oh, chicka, chicka, chicka! <laughs> it's all, it's, it just looks like it's falling apart. It is falling apart, trust me, much past that, you'll die. Begin the, into this irrecoverable vibration. There's limitations. Whoa, look at that kick back in the air. Oh, doesn't like going too fast, does it? No. Ah! Did you see that over MP? I know, uh, well, it's just a little coloured blob down below, and I'm focused on putting it in there. Uh oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Jeez, what the hell? I uh, just wanted to do a tight turn, I lost, huh? that's all. I lost control there for a second, whoa. Well, it is an old helicopter, and it's not an easy old helicopter. Yeah. yeah I'm pretty sure, ah, I got, got him, got him, and there's Voodoo. I'm pretty sure that uh, what, I, what I did um, would have completely wrecked the real thing. Well, you want to follow up completely wrecking that one. Keith, uh, while you've got the, uh, the the rescue kit, can you press R and activate the winch? Sure. R. R. Yep, the guy's moved onto the winch, he's now in the winch. I can see him over a multiplayer, he's sitting there. Well, standing there, hanging there, dangling. You know what this scenery really needs here, though? And, and I'm serious about this, there's some little flocks of sheep. See, can you lower your winchman? Put them back. Yep. Yep, it's going up and down on the there as well. Okay, wait a second, let me just get into a stable hover here. <laughs> yeah, there's no such if thing. If I can there's do no that. no such thing. Yeah, wait a second. You have to. You have Something to be, like it. You have to be on the controls to keep that in a hover, so you don't have enough hands. Yep, there he goes. It works with a multiplayer. Okay, so that's usable. Press R again and stick him back in the back seat. There he is. That's him. Oh Jesus! Mind the trees. Mind the trees. Mind the trees. I don't know, I'm not using the hover a little bit. A little sinking a little bit, but yeah. If you keep if you keep kind of the controls, you can hover it. But if you're not really working the controls, it won't hover. Yeah, that's right. It's and just, uh, it it's really, thing. yeah, it's really a hard job actually doing it uh, with a with a stick with springs uh, equipped. That's like, um, yeah. Oh yeah, because it wants to spring back on you. Yeah, and it's like, uh, you know, yeah, yep, yep, yep. It's yeah, giving me a mouse. hard time actually controlling this thing at all. Yeah, I'm flying on a mouse, and then uh, you know, yep. once you you get it established, it's probably easier. Yeah. The thing is, though, when you go from this little helicopter into one of the others, you can't fly them. 
Yeah, this takes a few minutes to uh, uh, get your head out of it. Kind of stable now. It can be quite stable in flight. It, it, you know, if you're working the controls, there's no reason why you can't hover it. If you if you try and treat it like one, like if you think you're in a wildcat and think it's just going to sit yeah. there, you're just not going to happen. I was just going to say, it ain't a wildcat. No, it's a world of difference. It ain't one of them Pope copters neither. I like that one. No, That's... it's not a Pope. Although you may visit the Pope if you uh, try and find this too hard. He may, well, he may visit you. Did you know <laughs> that the uh, the current Pope is a real helicopter pilot? Is he? Yeah, he's got a rating. He's got a license. Cool. Oh. Why is the papal helicopter all the time, I guess? Francesco. Right? Uh, I don't know. The Papa. Okay, so. You've got a little high altitude helicopter here. Uh, if you put it in, I'm giving it an altitude, the altitude record, weight configuration sort of thing, so you can take it. You can set it up for the altitude record and go for it basically. It climbs like a scalded cat, like that. Yeah, 1400 feet per minute's no big deal for this thing. He's above you, too. Yep, I'm looking right at him. Except uh, I got spun around by the wind there because I was looking at his butt. <laughs> yep, that thing climbs fast. Fast. It is going to be climbing on it. It does. Whoa. Yeah, the, the latest autopilot seems to be, once it settles in, pretty good too. Yeah, it's, it's great. it seems to match quite well with the, the autopilot up there, isn't it? So. It's got its uses, it will fly. You just have to watch your speed. Okay, I didn't dare putting it in uh, <laughs> up to now. No, it, it, it's the same sort of thing. Get it get it going and get it in the direction you want, then engage. But it will climb, it will turn, and uh, it will follow a route if you want it as well. Okay. It's not too bad, you just have to make sure the power's right, otherwise you'll go over the, the v and &E and uh, uh, it will kill you now, very spectacular. Oh okay. yeah, she'll shake you right down and spit you out. But I think it's going to be a really nice little helicopter when it's finished. It's a really nice little helicopter now. Yeah, and it looks like a little dragonfly. <laughs> like flying candy. Big buggy eyes on the side. What? Those uh, those manners you've got on get stolen from the, the 350. Okay. So are the baskets. Are yeah. Here. The baskets were. Uh, oh. They were accessories for the 350 that I didn't use. Uh, so couldn't really think of a way of using them in any of the configuration we had. So they they were pushed into this because they looked about the right size and shape for the baskets for the. Lama. All right. Take it off, Jesus. Yeah, you, you don't lose all the by pushing the nose over on this thing. No. no. <laughs> okay, engines. Engines are throttle. Throttle is at zero. You know, I'm auto rotating. It can auto rotate quite nicely. Just, uh, it does. Manage your collective. Don't let the RPMs go too high. What's your altitude, dude? Uh, seven thousand two hundred. Oh, I was at twenty. Was it twenty-four thousand? The last time I ordered it down. Yeah, it takes a long time to get down from there. It does. Yeah, that's right. How do you uh, actually lower the RPM uh, without actually throttling up? Just no, you just increase collective. 
Uh, you, oh, well, you just dumped the collector, haven't you? You haven't, you haven't shut the Oh, wait a sec. No, I haven't shut down anything. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> You're right. Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. You dumped sorry. the collector. You didn't shut the collector. You didn't shut the engine down idle. You're not even trying to come down, dude. If you shut the engines to idle and then just want the collector, you, you'd be alright. Okay, down. shutting shutting down the engines. No, I didn't mean to shut them all. Never mind. There's no coming back from this one now, you know that. Yep. You're gonna we'll have, see. You're gonna have to authorize now. I mean if you use the it works with the same engine power command, like middle mouse button well, middle mouse button and drag the mouse to twist the grip. User joined your Yeah. Team. Hello, I'm back. back. Yeah. Hello, welcome back. Welcome back. There seems to be, and you can get that into a uh, sort of little equilibrium on the descent rate with it. It sits quite nicely, it holds its RPMs at a certain rate. Yeah, I guess so, huh? Wait a sec, let me just get a little slower here. That's something around 80 knots, I think. Not sure. Okay, like that. Oh, you're losing revs. You're losing revs. I am. What the hell? You're gonna die, dude. Two old guys that went all the way. Start the ship, you shaking shimmy. The guy in the back looks even worse now. If he yeah, he looks like he's <laughs> ill. Actually, I found this a, a, quite an easy helicopter to rotate. Ah! Almost had to be doing. I'm fine. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, Gide says, um, went splat. Yeah, that was the, that was. <laughs> I can't get it, mate. It didn't work. Get your winchman ready, Voodoo. Hello, over here! Over here! We need to work on that script at some point. You know the rescue script? Hmm. Remember we had a look at it before? No one really did much with it. Sudden change of weight there, Voodoo. Down here someplace. Could be a good gimmick if we could fire up some sort of uh, flare or something like that. Uh, yeah. A flare or uh, smoke or something. Yeah. yeah. Have you seen him? I don't see him yet. Yep, right below me. Right, if you go to third person view and watch the video, you'll see that thumb down below. Press R, press uh, R to activate your winch. There we go, and just lower them down. Go pick up the sticky. Oh, he's coming down rather quick. Oh, he's going down very quick. Oh, there we go. <laughs> that that rotor wash effect is quite nice. I like that. Yeah. And the tail warp we do, you're on a slope. Oh, 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 forward, 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 forward. Watch out. Jesus. Watch out! Ah! Amateur chopper pilot trying to save another guy that's even more pathetic than me. <laughs> 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 Did I say that out loud? That's not what I meant. Except for that. Ah! Except for that, yeah. 
I'm just gonna Please. land. That's way easier to let him get in here than it is to try to lower someone down and kill him. Well, you know, watching you, I'd rather stay on the ground now. Oh, fine. I'll just go home then. How's that? <laughs> Come on, work the pedals, man! And he's turned. Now get over nice. here, get in. You're coming home Alrighty. with me. You're upside down, yeah, dude! Wait up. Broke my leg, man. <laughs> yeah, is that what you call that? <laughs> Not that one. Okay, I just put out smoke if landed on good. Yeah, lose, lose, lose. Put the winch dude away. Hey, right, let's go home. Yep. Go home. All right. Well, I'll... see me. I'm, I'm sitting in the in the, the back. You it's me. Looking really well. Making that face, yeah. Yeah, you know, that face when you just shredded like a, a million dollars. That's like got tears on it. So, <laughs> final thoughts and comments I like it. I, I like it a lot. It's a, it's, it's a nice challenge, you know. That's cool. Very rewarding if you fly it correctly. Vicious yeah. if you don't. Yeah, exactly. And of course, I should have uh, practiced the uh, auto rotations in a 206 or something like that before. Yeah, I was not going to help you auto rotate this. <laughs> no, it's 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 a good looking one, I have to say. Um, really, the bare bone look, of course, um, and how it's actually put together. And uh, I'm actually looking forward for uh, you know seeing all the liveries. Yeah. That Gary's putting together. I'll stress for again for whoever's watching this video, this development video. It looks funky at the moment because uh, it's the whole thing's been remapped and it's got temporary texture on it so we can map it properly and uh, do some proper paint work on it. What do you mean funky? It looks funky. Funky. Funky chicken. Very attractive. I like the whole thing. I do like it. Yeah, it is cool. The Just took sound. a nice screenshot. The multiplayer sound actually works not too bad in it as well. Yeah, it's quite nice. Um, you know, we just might, you know, we, we might just need uh, to add some uh, startup and uh, yeah, in interior, exterior startup sound, depending on uh, if you've got windows and stuff like that. Um, yeah, something like that. Yeah, a very thin perspex bubble, I don't think the windows make much difference with that. Okay. But, yeah, you can do it. Yeah. Um, the, the, the rotor vortex interaction sound, I think, needs to be... Yeah. We need to find somewhere doing that or multiplayer, because that's missing the, you know, that would, that would sound a lot better as well. Rather than just hearing the plain rotor sound. Yeah, we'll probably listen to um, a real llama getting into that state, B. You see, you hear a rotor, you hear rotor noise of the llama the whole time. Mm -hmm. But it just, I've done it in an internal view, but it doesn't shoot it. You can't hear it in an external shoot, it sounds, you can hear the, the rotor beat intensify with the more collective you put on. Okay. You can hear that in internal view, but you can't, it's not working in the next channel yet, I think. Or well, it is working next channel, it's not working across multiplayer next channel. Yeah, okay. It might be just a volume level thing, I'm not sure. The only thing is with this old chopper, it takes you a while to go anyway. Yeah, because you don't want to go over 115 knots. Now, if you do, you're not going to go anywhere at all, it's up down. And you need good controls. Uh, and you need good controls, you also need a good friend with another one that can rescue you. Yeah.
And it looks like Brian Candy. Please watch that video. I will watch it later. Yep, nope. That's okay. It's a, it's a nice little agile helicopter, which is not fast. No, that's okay. Yeah, that's okay. Some things are better done slowly. <laughs> Multiplayer payload options that I've got set with that different technique I was using, Gid, it's working. Nice. Because it's set to exclude the doors on the, the rescue model, and the doors are gone. And that's, I, can, I can tell that over multiplayer, so that, that works. If you look at the videos on the doors. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so we, uh, yeah, but, but uh, you have to, like, um, change the whole thing, right? The whole structure of actually to enable this uh, behavior, right? Yeah, it's just a different way I thought about doing it. Um, it, it. Whether it actually makes the whole thing easier to work with in the long run or not, I'm not quite sure yet, but we'll see. Hmm. No, we might actually try it in the, uh, with the other one. And, uh,. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, I was, I was experimenting with this one a little bit. So. But uh, certainly that uh, rotor wash effect, uh, that can get farmed out to the laws. It works, and it does exactly what it's supposed to. Who is uh, descending quite gingerly? Oh, what happened there? Take the autopilot off, didn't you? I just twitched. Tick, tick, tick. Got a tick. A tick, 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 tick. Looks like a perfect approach <laughs> so far. That's cool. I've, I've done this before, but you know, I can screw this stuff up in a second. Mm hmm. I'm good at nothing. Yeah, all of us do. <laughs> like, I'm flying along, I'm having a good time. Uh, dun, 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 we're dead. Yeah. I'm in terror of you watching you come in there. Ah, oh, look at that beautiful cloud. <laughs> 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 I haven't put the onions in the cockpit yet. They're, 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 oh, we've got to have onions. They're, they're fatal. And fuzzy oh. dice. I haven't got fuzzy dice yet. Well, we can do that. You can see approaching from the distance. Oh, some taxi on the ground here. What's, what else is here? Uh, there's a P-38. Oh, All yeah. right. Okay. See the P-38 L I got. Oh. Oh, good. Hmm? I've got the distance set on that engine sound perfectly. I can just hear it, it's starting to fade in as Vudu is approaching there. It didn't cut in, it faded in. Oh, nice. Ah, I'm on the wrong tower position. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait a sec. Uh, I could actually shift over to you. I'm not anywhere near there. I'm parked out in the middle of nowhere. Oh, you are, right, yeah. Uh, uh, maybe I, I maybe just, the, the dumped, P38. I dumped my helicopter somewhere and went for a walk. And it, yeah, it sounds quite nice. I'm actually listening to it uh, from the P-38's uh, uh, perspective. Yep. Llama Llama. Llama Llama Llama. I really have trouble with this. It... When you're landing.
Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> nice down. Hey, you don't like the way I fly? Stay off the sidewalk. <laughs> okay, <laughs> wait a sec. I'm leaving the aircraft now. Alright, okay. The video's terminating for the night. That's the end of that developmental snapshot video.